Hello, this is uh, Big Boss Jim coming to you almost live from Big Boss Jim's model shop. As usual, there's a story <clears throat> behind each model that I do. This one is a model of a car that my middle brother was going to buy me provided I graduated from high school. This was back well, I graduated in 59. So, it was probably early 59. The car belonged to my cousin. Uh, it had had some work done to it. It was all white. And uh, even though I never got the car, there was a uh, reason for it. And uh, yes, I did graduate from high school. But, uh, this was a uh, pretty bad time. I'll tell you guys about it later because this same brother, I've got a couple of models I want to do in memory of him. So I'll tell you about it at a later date, okay? But this is what I got. Uh, this is what I started with. It was a rather simple kit. Not too much to it in one sense. But uh, what I did to it, it uh, or this is what I wanted to do to that same car uh, had I ever owned it. So I'll switch off here and uh, I'll show you what I did. The car is not completed yet. I still have some more to do to it. I have some touch-ups to do to it. Uh, the car has been rubbed, but it has not been clear coated. Uh, but if I may, I will give you um, uh, some things of what I've done to it. Okay, it's been uh, lowered dramatically. Uh, I have a, a complete upholstery interior in it, spare tire, two box. The bumpers on it are from. A DeSoto back in the days, as is the grill. The grill is 51 DeSoto, and uh, they were used extensively back in those days. There's a chrome core support in it, radiator support for some of you. Uh, what else? Uh, some, oh, as I said, it's not been clear coated yet. Uh, the kit did come with the bucket seats, but I was not too happy with the seats. So, what I did is what most of us did back in those days, because there was a shortage on bucket seats. Well, there just wasn't too many of them to be had. So, let me uh, cut here and I'll be right back. As I was stating back in those days there wasn't many versions of uh, bucket seats. Few but not not that many. So what we did back then uh, was we would uh, go to an upholstery shop and we would have the original seats uh, cut and made into buckets. And they could be any worse from something as simple as what I've done here or they could really be something elaborate. Uh, this one has an all leather interior. It has black stitching uh, on the three seats, the rear and the, the, and the front. Uh, I hope I've got pictures of it uh, separate, but it's got it's got seat belts in it. I don't know if you can see them or not. 
uh, gear shifter uh, was put on the floor uh, it has the black gauges uh, this one I also put a seat in the TV I'll have to search back and see if I uh, made interior pictures of it but as I said uh, I'm not done with it yet I got a few things to do uh, uh, it has pretty decent paint job on it excuse the lint on the thing there you can see some of the interior a little better uh, As I said, I'm not I'm not finished with the uh, model yet. Uh, I got some touch up to do here and there. Uh, the clear coat put on it. Uh, it does have the spotlights on it, and uh, I got the lights in place to put on it yet. You can see a little mark on each bumper where I want the center of the lights in place on the bumper. Uh, the side pipes, uh, I used part of the kit and the long pipes I, I made from uh, styrene. And uh, it's got the uh, steel wheels, chrome steel wheels on it with baby moons and the uh, wide white walls. So it is set up and done as would be back in those days. This was this was our customizing. Uh, I hope you like it. I'll have some uh, other pictures of it, and when I finish it, I'll make a little addition to this video. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you like it. Let me get it back down on its all fours here. There you go, and once again, let you see what it looks like with the hood drop closed on it. Uh, I was thinking about putting pinstripes on the hood and the deck lid, but uh, I kind of like the cleaner looks a little better. Uh, they both have been shaved, the uh, trunk and the uh, hood. Uh, I'll explain the rest of the story later guys okay thanks I'll get this part of it to the editing and uh, go from there till later guys bye bye